Welcome to another unboxing video. Today we'll be unboxing the 12 inch open skillet by Extrema. I've been interested in buying ceramic cookware for a while. I own a lot of different kinds of cookware. I've tried metal skillets and I've tried ceramic covered metal skillets. These are the metal skillets would put stuff in your food if you scrape them too hard. So I switched to ceramic and then I found the ceramic coated skillets were chipping into my food. So I thought I would try 100% ceramic because it's supposedly the healthiest for you. Right off the bat, when I open this box, I see this big yellow notice. New important tips on how to cook with Extrema. Do not go above medium. Okay, well worn. If I go above medium, I cannot be held responsible for the actions of my pan. I actually appreciate that they're giving this many instructions here, however, I admit I am a little bit concerned about a product that requires this many instructions. I've been using pans for a while. I would hope to know how to use mine already. And I kind of like things that are good to go out of the box. This is reading. This is a page of reading. And I am a modern person, so that means... Nope, not going to read that now. Next thing I see is, oh, it looks like a little product catalog for Extrema cookware and teapots. No, it's not. No, it's a warranty. That's good. I appreciate a warranty. Ten-year warranty. Take a look at that. Ten-year warranty. From thermal shock only. Okay, regular warranty is 30 days. And then more instructions, more reading. More care and safety. Ooh. This pan has come with more instructions than my last dog. Let's see if it's worth it. All right. Reading aside, let's get to the good parts. Actually, get rid of this styrofoam here. And here is the pan itself revealed. Extra piece of cardboard. Uh, ceramic is supposed to be heavier than normal. Let's see how heavy this guy actually is. And uh, he's kind of hefty. Yep, yeah, he's heavy. <laughs> I will admit that he is. He's got a good hunk of weight to him. And mine, ooh, uh-oh, are these scratches or are these, no, these are little hairs. Got little hairs all over the bottom. I'm sure they'll wash off, probably something to do with the packing process. Just so you know, if you buy one of these and you look at the bottom of the pan and it looks like there are little scratches, try and brush them off first because they might be little hairs. As promised in the instructions, this does have a nice glossy sheen. Feels like high quality pottery. That's kind of the idea I think they're trying to get across here, and it seems that they have succeeded in that. Lots of little marks on the side that make it look like wear, but they actually are just dust for the most part. A little bit of an imperfection here. but mostly pretty good looking. All right, here's the bottom. Extrem a 12 inch open skillet. And it comes with this neat little rubber handle. There is a handle-free version of this skillet. It 
basically just this round part without the long handle on the end. And when you go to the website, it's pictured with two of these red rubber handles on the side. It's basically got two of these instead of one of these. And they show you basically this on the side of it. It's slightly cheaper than this model, but I wanted a handle, so I paid extra. And that, my friends, appears to be everything out of the box. Hold on. Let me move the box away and do a final formal presentation for you. All right, four. Depending on where you buy this, or between 180 and 200 some odd dollars, this pan can be yours. This is what you get, a lovely pan and the handle. If you want a lid, you have to buy that separately. Why? Because money's good and the people who make this pan like it. So that is the Extrema 12 inch open skillet. I will let you know what I think of it when I actually cook with it. Thank you for joining me.